And this event is a charity event. I'm trying to raise money for muscular dystrophy campaign. <laughs> Judging by the weather, the water levels and everything, it's going to be a very good weekend. <laughs> The days like this are great, both in terms of raising money and in terms of raising awareness. Well, M Muscle Industry Campaign was 50 years old last year, and you know, in that period, we've spent you know millions and millions of pounds. We've spent over a million pounds a year on medical research, and that is that is making a difference. Also, on this trip, we have one family who. Their son Carson suffers from muscular dystrophy and he's also going to come down the river in the raft. Right, let's have the crew down then. At this age, you know, he's able to do quite a lot of things, but as he does age, um, he'll lose the ability to do things and eventually lose the ability to walk, usually by the age of about 10, 11. Um, the boys or girls go into a wheelchair full time. Well, treatments are getting better so that you know people are living much, much longer than they used to. And the provision of care, and that's something where the Muscle and Dystrophy campaign does a lot, through the lobbying of the National Health Service and the training of people to give the right care, it's getting a lot better. I think awareness is important when dealing with these kind of things. Um, that's why we do a lot of uh, awareness along with our fundraising. We should at least go down it. Do you want us to go down the waterfall? <laughs> so if people, more people know about it, the more people who can help us and uh, try to, you know, try to get a, a cure or a treatment that will, that will work and uh, prolong their lives and give them a better quality of life in the end.